My prints from the first video, you can just see here quite a, a ghostly mandala from the Impressibles, and this one the Circles also from the Impressibles, and this one I completed off camera but exactly the same technique. Now I'm going to finish this one today. This mandala really needs pulling out so I can see the ghostly shape of it here. So to do that I'm going to use a white pen, I'm using a Posca, but any white gel pen. And then I'm going to use some um, Distress crayons in similar colours to pull out the shape of the mandala. So I've picked out distress crayons in similar colour, could be anything, gelatos, neo colours, scribble sticks, any of those kind of things. And I'm just going to use tone on tone to pull out the shape of what's already here. Now these are nice to use because they're very blendable. If you wanted to you could do that with a water brush. shape of that mandala coming out now. You can do this as neatly or as loose and scribbly as you want. My go-to is always to go a little bit scribbly but you could do it very neatly if you wanted to. I've cut out my heart from my mini petite gel plate. I'm going to add it in the middle at some point so I'm not going to do too much work in the middle. What I might do just to define this mandala shape a little bit more with a very dark pencil just at the tips of the shape I'm just going to add a little bit more shading. Around the edge here it makes a great shape for journaling so still with my white Posca I'm going to add some journaling around the edge. shape to add some glitter to as well so just to define this outer edge I think I've added enough shading now with the distress crayons and the pencil to really bring out that mandala shape even though it's retained its very distressed look I want now to add this heart from the petite print that I did earlier I'm going to put that in the middle with a bit of stitching I may stitch along the edges and I've added this little quote it says karma rules because this to me is very circular what goes around comes around takes me back to karma I'm going to add the quote there and then finally when I've done the stitching I'm going to add it to my journal thank you so much for watching see you next time